Assalamu alaikum viewers. Welcome to my channel Genome Wide Study. If you are new on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon. So you will get the notification of all the new videos. In this video, we will try to construct the Ramachandran plot of our protein sequence. But before constructing the Ramachandran plot, we must know that what is Ramachandran plot and what is its importance in determining the protein conformation and structure. So what is Ramachandran plot? The Ramachandran plot is a plot of torsional angles that is phi and psi of the residue that is amino acid contained in the peptide or protein. Ramachandran plot provide us distribution of conformational angle phi and psi in protein structure. The area of the Ramachandran plot help us to know that what type of rotation of dihedric or torsional angle leads to the production of protein backbone like, like their uh, alpha sheet or beta sheet and also it helps us to di distinguish between the distribution of the conformational angle which are favorable for studied protein and also for some conformational angle which are not favorable. We know that protein molecule is mostly present in stable condition and to maintain its stability the alpha and beta sheet in protein secondary structure world align in a particular angle. When we draw the plot of the torsional uh, angle phi and psi, we get the four quadrants of the plot. Like here, this one is called the first quadrant, while this one is the second, this one is the third, and this one is the fourth quadrant. And the distribution here, th this plot in the Ramachandra plot, the phi angles were present in the x axis, while the psi angle were present in the y axis. If the structure or amino acids have the plus and b uh, minus angle, means the when the psi angle is a positive here and the phi angle is negative so it contains the beta sheet but before going to further we must know that this the distribution of each quadrant is or excess is about minus 182 plus 180 here is also minus 82 uh, plus 180 and this first quadrant contains the positive uh, psi angle and negative phi angle. Here the second the both angles were negative. In the third uh, sorry in the second the both angles were positive. While in the fourth the phi angle is positive while the psi angle is negative. So when the amino acid lies in the uh, psi is positive and phi is negative then it makes the beta sheet. Well, when both the angles were <coughs> have the positive, uh, so it gives the left-handed alpha helix of the protein secondary structure. But when the both the uh, when the amino acid lies in both in a uh, uh, negative, either have psi and phi are negative, then it has a right-handed alpha helix. And this. Uh, Ramachandra plot also gives us about the allowed and disallowed region. Region in the in this plot, you see the different color: the red, yellow, green. And these colored regions are presented the allowed region in which the amino acid present. While the re re uh, remaining were the disallowed region. All the amino acids present in the protein structure are 
lies in the allowed region while uh, glycine it can be present in allowed or disallowed region here the red color showed the most core region or <coughs> while the <coughs> uh, yellow is the allowed and uh, uh, green is the generous but now if you want to get more information about ramachandran plot so you can search it in the internet or any other source so you will get the better information from this but now we will try to construct this structure that how to plot the ramachandran plot of our protein sequence so how to do let's start go to google open the google search engine and write weather the v a d a r and then click on this first link so here you see the window but constructing the ramachandra plot you must have the pdb file of your protein sequence so how to make the pro pdb file of your uh, protein sequence you must uh, watch our previous video the link of that video is present in the video description so here select desired pdb file so you choose your pdb file of protein and or you can also enter the accession number because here if you have downloaded the pdb file from any online data source so it has a uh, code so you give our accession number so you give the accession number here and remain the option say here leave it as it is or you want to change so it depends on you and then click on submit when the ramachandra plot analysis in the weather uh, so uh, also is uh, finished so it gives you this option so here are the one is this is the ramachandra plot and here are some other uh, tables that give the information about uh, this plot so here is our protein plot so our most of the amino acid lies in the core region where the allowed region uh, here is the legend of uh, this uh, plot uh, that what is here is the core allowed uh, generous this allowed these are also allowed and these are the glycine here you see as we told the glycine can be lie uh, present in the allowed or disallowed region uh, here also present in the disallowed region where also present in the allowed region where uh, no other amino acid is present in the disallowed region so you can copy it like uh, click on right click and save it or copy it and save it uh, anywhere where, where you want to keep it and here are the some information about the amino acid that which amino acid Uh, make what type of sheet if it's a coil or a helix or like this and uh, here is the angle value about pi psi here is also uh, give the amino acids and its uh, uh, structure and here are so be between two amino acids is and this is the bond distance and this is the angle between these two amino acids and energy bond energy uh, about these amino acids is this, this type of information when this is scroll down 
So here also gives about the amino acids. These are side donor and acceptor. These are distance between these. Here it gives the statistic that how many amino acids are in helix or how many in beta and how many in coil. And uh, here it gives the hydrogen bond information. It gives the dihedral angle information that helix pi or helix psi. And uh, this information about accessible area the where it lies and it gives the amino acid sequence and here is the torsion angle value and here is omega and these are wonderful forces and this is the legend that if the three really is it is best while zero is the worst and a star indicates possible problem occurs in these amino acids. So these are the information about the Ramachandra plot that how to generate and how it, what is in it important. Besides beside this uh, weather there are also other uh, online servers that can generate the Ramachandra plot and give, you can use also use them like uh, when you write in the Google search uh, Ramachandra plot generator so it gives many more other tools or uh, online data sources like here is a uh, Verwick and uh, this one is the Ramachandra plot from VLab here is also you can choose the PDB file and generate Ramachandra plot or here is also another one is about Swift lab so here also you can choose your PDB file and generate the Rama Chandran plot so this is our video about how to construct the Rama Chandran plot and what are its importance hopefully it will help you thank you